Hi, this is Dr. Jeffrey Tucker, and I want to share with you what my practice has evolved to, and I call it the polite method, P-O-L-I-T-E. We all remember that we were taught the mnemonic RICE, R-I-C-E, and remember the R stood for rest, and I was for ice, and C was compression, and the E was elevation. And then over the years, that became price, protect it, rest it, ice, compression, elevation. So in my practice, I use polite. P stands for certainly protect the area. It stands for posture. It stands for pain relief. It stands for definitely how am I going to prevent future episodes and importantly, plan. So all of those things, all those P's are important to me, but I find that the three most important words that patients want to hear is I have a plan. So after I've done my history, I've done my consultation, I've done my examination, I can sit down with that patient and say, here's my plan and thoroughly write it out for the patient so that they understand what to expect from us. The O and the L in polite stands for optimal loading. So I think it's really important not to overload muscles or joints and same time don't underload them. So I use equipment like the CLX bands, body weight exercises. It could be sometimes the sandbags, sometimes the kettlebells or free weights to get that load properly so that I'm not aggravating the patient but at the same time I am optimally loading their muscles and joints for recovery. So you have the P, the O, the L, the I. I to me is the reminder to talk about ice or heat. In my office it could be ice packs, it could be using biofreeze, it could be my reminder also for instruments. I use a lot of different types of instruments in my office and that could include the different Graston tools or the eye, eye instrument assisted soft tissue mobilization techniques. These are all things that are available to us. So you have the P, the O, the L, the I, the T I use for technology. I have a lot of technology in my office. I embrace shockwave devices. I embrace laser. I embrace lymphatic drainage devices, the Skinar device. So. I think it's important that, that we do embrace technology that will help control our patient's pain, whether it's acute or chronic. And then the E, which is really important, is a reminder for me to talk to my patients about eating, talk to them about exercise, talk to them about ergonomics. I think ergonomics is hugely, hugely, you know, under, you know, uh, discussed with our patients, proper sitting standing, all of these things that would come under ergonomics, their chair, their desk height, whether they need a sit to stand desk, whether they have a proper computer uh, keyboard tray, all comes under that ergonomics and that's how I put together this polite method that I teach in my classes to students as well as doctors.